Scranton tonight. Hundreds came together to run for Boston. The monthly Run Around Scranton event was dedicated this month to the city of Boston. Newswatch 16's Sarah Bynowski is live from the Scranton Running Company tonight with a story of overwhelming support. Sarah. Well, Sophia Scott, organizers say in the four days since the attacks, they decided to make this run in honor of the victims in Boston. And the organizers say they are both amazed and touched by the outpouring of support from people here in the Scranton area. First, there was a moment of silence, then a prayer. As we run this race tonight for our fellow Bostontonians, may we go forth with this blessing. May God bless you and your families. And then more than 400 runners hit the Lackawanna River Heritage Trail here in Scranton. What was the monthly Run Around Scranton event was transformed into a 5K run for Boston, a show of support for a city devastated by bombings during Monday's Boston Marathon. Just wanted to join in the support <laughs> of Boston and what happened on, on Monday. Some of the runners here have run the Boston Marathon in the past. Some were even there Monday, but thankfully were not affected by the violence. It went from that joyful time to what looked like a war zone. It was pretty scary. Organizers were selling yellow t-shirts to raise money for the victims in Boston. Somebody to try to, uh, you know, put a damper on it is just devastating. So we're going to, you know, we're obviously fighting back. The last thing we're going to do is stop running. So uh, it's the least we can do. And those who weren't wearing the yellow shirts were wearing other Boston gear. Lifelong Yankees fans were wearing Red Sox shirts. Like I can't imagine waking up and, and not having any legs or no arm. You know, it's, it's tragic. You know, you see photos and all of that and it just hits your heart. So here I am. And after the run tonight, those who participated were treated to meals donated by area restaurants. Sarah Bynowski, Newswatch 16, reporting live tonight in Scranton.